Hey everybody, what's going on? Vinny here from the AndroidAction.com. Here today I'm going to review the Nova Launcher for those of you that have received ice cream sandwich on your device. Um, it, Nova Launcher is a uh, home replacement launcher that will give you a new look and feel, kind of like ice cream sandwich, uh, stock stock ice cream sandwich feel I should say I guess um, it's got some nice um, transition effects, some nice customization um, there's a free version and a four dollar version uh, the free version uh, will give you just the normal you know launcher skills you know able to change around some things but doesn't get too intense um, the paid version I'll just go to the app real quick here and oh, that's not what I want go to Nova Launcher Prime is what they call it and the paid version will get you uh, hidden apps, gestures, uh, dock swipes, uh, unread counts and more scrolling effects so that's pretty cool um, you do have uh, three three docks which is cool you can mess around with those um, you know you can customize them as you want, you want to put the Play Store down there right down there you want to show preview instead of the app drawer in the middle pull up the show preview of all your screens. We can jump to screen over here and just scroll through. As you can see it's got this nice cool flip card animation. There's a couple more that you can mess with as well. Um, it's a really nice little launcher. It's pretty lightweight. It doesn't come with a lot of widgets or anything. Um, you know you can tap up here you know, to mess with your widgets. It doesn't give you the option of them being in the app drawer. Uh, which is kind of strange, but I haven't really figured that out yet. We'll go into the settings real quick, and we can take a look at some things. You can uh, mess with your desktop. Uh, you know, mess with uh, if it's a five by five, four by four, six by five uh, desktop grid. Um, you can um, choose whether or not to have the persistent search bar at the top, which I disabled. Uh, you can have a different scrolling effects. You can uh, mess with your infinite scroll on all screens. I'll go ahead and turn that one on. Um, you can mess with your drawer so you can have the style either a horizontal or a vertical app drawer. Just a bunch of cool things. Uh, ones right here hide apps and drawer groups, which are prime versions, so it's going to cost you $4. Also, you have, uh, if you didn't see in there, you have a background transparency, so we'll just throw that in the middle and see what happens in a second. Uh, dock, you can mess with your dock settings. Um, you know, sh infinite scrolling, show. Uh, show shadow, all that kind of stuff, doc pages, number of uh, pages, look and feel, not too much customization here, just uh, screen orientation, uh, screen speed, uh, animation speed, all that kind of stuff. Uh, folders, which is cool, I'll show you uh, what our folders look like, you can mess with it, have a stack a grid or a fan view of the icons, and then we can go here and choose circle, square, or platform, which is neat. Or you can do a custom one, which I found pretty neat, but uh, you know, didn't choose to do that. But uh, we'll go back in here and see now our app drawer is transparent. Looks pretty nice. I'm digging it. I might keep it that way. So, in any event, I mean, it's pretty nice. See here, uh, there's a folder that I have. You just tap it and boom. You know, it looks normal like uh, ice cream sandwich would. You can name the folder. We'll name it. Uh, well, actually, I'm not going to go through all that. We'll just leave it as it is. But uh, in any event, it's a very freaking cool launcher. Uh, Nova Launcher. It's free and paid. So depending on if you want those extra capabilities to be able to hide bloatware and stuff like that, uh, you know, I would recommend buying the. Uh, the paid version for only four dollars it's not too bad so with all that being said guys I mean uh, if you have any questions or anything you can contact me on YouTube below on uh, the comments or on the site on the comments or hit me up on Twitter or Facebook um, on our respective pages all those links will be down below for you to uh, be able to contact me also don't forget to subscribe if you haven't subscribed subscribe you know we have phone phone reviews app reviews app lists, uh, how to's, how to roots, all that sort of stuff going on on this channel, very cool channel. Uh, so, subscribe if you haven't yet. Uh, keep watching guys for the next video, and I'll see you in the next one.